then. Only two weeks to go until NXT Battleground. Welcome to NXT. And we are set to kick off the show in a big way tonight. Battle Royal action to determine the next contenders to the tag team titles. And representing the family from Oak Park, Illinois, weighing in at 196 pounds. Tony D'Angelo! So every superstar in this battle royal will represent their respective teams. And the winner will earn their team a shot at the NXT Tag Team Titles. Tony D'Angelo, of course, representing the family. Who's moving on to Battleground? with a shot at the gold. Here comes the man representing Hit Row. Who's it gonna be? It's a Shantae Adonis. And representing Hit Row from Baltimore, Maryland, weighing in at 209 pounds. A lot of superstars wanting their shot, their opportunity at the NXT Tag Team Championship. Only one of these teams will be going a battleground, however. That much is set in stone. And here comes the final competitor in this battle royal. Representing Gallus, it's Joe Coffey. And from Glasgow, Scotland, weighing in at 243 pounds, Joe Coffey. So you are eliminated by being thrown over the top rope. Both feet need to hit the floor. The last man standing will be the winner and advance the battleground in two weeks. Every man for themselves in this type of matchup. And we are underway. Six superstars, each representing their respective teams. And Idris Inove represents the prospects rolling right now. Look at him go. Oh, and Joe Coffey with that massive shoulder tackle. Look at a shot With a shot to the face of Coffey. We've also got Brooks Jensen in there. Representing his team, of course, with Josh Briggs. Good Andre Chase representing Chase U, but oh my goodness, Anofe rolling through with that sunset flip power bomb. Jawbreaker now by Joe Coffey. And Anofe still fighting back. Vertical suplex there from Coffey. And now Andre Chase, atomic drop. And oh, Tony D is gone. There's the first elimination tonight. The family will not be going to battleground. Tony D'Angelo eliminated. Who will advance to NXT battleground? Who will get an opportunity at the tag team titles? Right now, Brooks Jensen looking good as he drives a knee into the spine of Andre Chase. 
Elbow there to a no-play. Now targeting Joe Coffey as Jensen, and oh, Coffey in trouble. But he remains in the matchup. And Adonis with a big clothesline. And now Joe Coffey gonna respond. Overhead belly to belly suplex. And now Anope catches the kick. Joe Coffey with another suplex. Now Brooks Jensen and Andre Chase going at it. Meanwhile, Joe Coffey looking for the elimination of Idris Anope. And he remains in this battle royal. Who's going to NXT Battleground as NXT rolls on live? We are back here on NXT as these superstars look to advance the battleground to get themselves a shot at the NXT Tag Team Titles. And Brooks Jensen sending Adonis into the corner. But he's fighting back. Went for the neck breaker countered by Brooks Jensen. And Jensen now thinking about a suplex perhaps. Adonis up high. But he lands on his feet. And right there to the back of the leg. Meanwhile, Joe Coffey eliminates Andre Chase. We are down to four superstars. Who will be moving on? Oh, and no fate with a great maneuver. Clawing Brooks Jensen face first. Now Joe Coffey getting double teamed by Adonis and Anofe. And oh, what a springboard drop kick. That alliance did not last long. Now Brooks Jensen trying to set up here. Shante Adonis set up on the ropes. Oh, but Anofe. Catching him with a kick. And now look at the speed and quickness here of Idris Anufe. And there's that sunset flip power bomb. And now Adonis right to the back of the leg of Anufe, slowing him down. Every man for themselves in this type of matchup. Pop up power bomb by Joe Coffey. Now Brooks Jensen picking his moment. Elbows low to the gut. And now Brooks Jensen over the top, and he was almost eliminated. Able to remain though in the fight is Brooks Jensen. Sure break of Coffey. And now Ashante Adonis trying to eliminate Jensen. Brooks Jensen in trouble. And now Joe Coffey sending Anofe over the top, and he's gone. Has been eliminated. Idris Anofe eliminated. We're down to three. Belly to back suplex there by Brooks Jensen. And now Coffey from behind plants him face first. And Adonis back up to his feet. Stomping on the arm there of Jensen and now delivering a drop kick in the corner to Coffey. And now Jensen with the kick. Now trying to set up Ashante Adonis. Reversal. And now look at these body shots. Adonis just screamed together. Whatever he can. It is all about heading to NXT Battleground. And there goes Adonis. Final two superstars in this battle royal are Brooks Jensen and Joe Coffey. And now Coffey, backbreaker. And uh oh. Brooks Jensen in trouble. Best of the Bills. What a discus clothesline. And now Jensen, thrown over the top rope. 
and he's gone. Joe Coffey earns Gallus a title opportunity. Here is your winner, Joe Coffey. Gallus are going to Battleground to face the Creed Brothers for the NXT Tag Team titles. Congratulations to Joe Coffey. We are back here on NXT, two weeks from Battleground. And there is the former NXT champion, the megastar, LA Knight, making his way out to the ring. And he has a lot to address after falling short at Halloween Havoc. He was unable to retain the NXT title against Braun Breaker in that triple street fight. He has a lot to get off his chest here this evening. LA Knight is back on NXT after a week's absence. We're gonna see what the Megastar has to say about his defeat against Braun Breaker, a Halloween Havoc. Let me talk to you. Braun, congratulations on beating me to become champion. I'll admit I got a little ahead of myself. I have a knack for doing that, but I want my rematch in two weeks at Battleground. I'm not done with this brand yet. Me and you are going to meet again in this ring, and when we do, the result will be different than Halloween Havoc, because as we've seen before, when me and you get put against one another in a regular one-on-one -on -one match, it's the megastar that comes out on top, yeah. Well, LA Knight wants his rematch in two weeks at Battleground for the NXT title. And this time, it's gonna be a regular one-on-one -on -one match. We are back here on NXT and our main event here tonight, we'll see LA Knight in action when he goes one-on-one -on -one with the modern-day Maharaja, Jinder Mahal. And speaking of LA Knight, it is official. In two weeks at NXT Battleground, the rematch is on between Breaker and Knight for the NXT title. Will the Megastar be able to reclaim the title? We'll find out in two weeks. Now we are set for more in-ring action as there is Carmelo Hayes. And as we approach NXT Battleground, a lot of superstars, maybe even every superstar, is looking to be a part of NXT's next premium live event. No more than this man. A superstar that refers to himself as him. He believes that he is the best NXT has to offer. A former NXT champion, a former NXT North American champion, Carmelo Hayes has all the talent in the world and he's not gonna prove it as he looks to build momentum heading into Battleground. Here comes his opponent, the mysterious Dexter Loomis. his opponent from Recluse, Wyoming, weighing in at 230 pounds, Dexter Loomis. Well, Dexter Loomis is certainly an interesting character. Very ominous man. Very mysterious. I don't think anyone truly knows his motives in NXT. Tonight he goes one-on-one -on -one with Carmelo Hayes. One of the very best that NXT has to offer. And this would be a massive victory for the career of Dexter Loomis. 
Here's the bell, we are now on the way. Hayes and Loomis, one on one. Dexter Loomis wasting no time, going right to work. Oh, but here comes Melo, fighting back, went for the super kick. Loomis able to evade. Now some big shots from the mysterious Loomis. Back elbow connects. Now the ground and pound here on Hayes. The NXT Universe firmly behind Mello in this one as Loomis is just choking him. Loomis trying to bend the rules around a little bit. And Loomis looking for a super kick. Hayes fighting back. And now Loomis set off the ropes. Hayes goes over. Catches him with a drop kick on the rebound. And oh, Hayes looking for a super kick of his own. Oh, and he caught him with an Inzaguri instead. Smart thinking there by Mello. And now Hayes sending Loomis into the corner. Nobody home. Hayes hit hard there on the top turnbuckle. And Loomis looking to take advantage. But Hayes lands on his feet. Belly to back suplex from Carmelo Hayes. And again, he was looking for the super kick. Caught a kick instead from Loomis right to the bread basket. Belly to back, kip up, into a leg drop. Loomis incredibly impressive. Here's the cover on Hayes for a two count. Again, as I said before, this would be a massive victory tonight for Dexter Loomis. If he can knock off one of the very best in NXT. Massive uppercut just rocked Carmelo Hayes. Oh, but Hayes now, reverse DDT. And now heading up to the middle rope is Melo. Melo's gonna fly. Crossbody got caught. Into a fall away slam. What impact. And now Dexter Loomis trying to follow up here. Trying to set up for the silence. Looking for that Urinogi. Carmelo Hayes was one step ahead. Now Loomis going to be set up. And Carmelo looking for his trademark fadeaway. Connects. Oh, but Loomis wisely heads to the apron. Oh, and there's a shot from Loomis now. Dexter Loomis trying to get back into this matchup. Hoisting on Carmelo Hayes again is Loomis. But now the elbows from Melo. And oh, he went for the first 48. Cross body instead from Loomis. And he hooks the leg. Cover here. Cover here for a two count. Dexter Loomis almost put away Melo. But alas, the matchup continues. And check out the strength. Not that time, said Carmelo Hayes. Went for the crossbody. Hayes reversing. And now Loomis out of the ring. Looking to create some separation. Can he bounce back here tonight on NXT? We are back here on NXT as Dexter Loomis takes on one of the very best that NXT has to offer in Carmelo Hayes. And Loomis looking for a big win here tonight. Back elbow there in the corner. And now Loomis plotting Hayes. What a slam. Can Loomis follow up now? He may have Hayes on the ropes. The uppercut will again daze him. And now Loomis just unloading. Boots to the midsection. And Hayes with a boot of his own. Melo trying to fight back. Oh, but Dexter Loomis. Reverse DDT. And Hayes tripping up Dexter Loomis. And what is Melo thinking? Looking to put Dexter Loomis away. Loomis able to counter. And oh, he went for the spine buster. What a great counter by Melo. And now Carmelo Hayes going up top. 
And this is not good news for Dexter Loomis. Mello's gonna fly, big close line from the top. And will that be enough to put down Loomis? Cover here, shoulders are down for a two count. Another near fall here tonight between these two superstars. Super kick connects. And Loomis. Back up to a vertical base. And Carmelo through the ropes. Hurricane Rana. And that may pay dividends for Melo. Oh, Loomis kicked out. And now Loomis picked back up to his feet again. Hayes, oh, went for another high risk. And this time, it didn't pay off. And Loomis was looking to set up for the silence. Hayes, able to counter first, 48. The first 48 there to Loomis. And now Hayes back up to the high rent district. Melo looking to shoot. And he don't miss. Nothing but net for Hayes. Come on. Hayes gets the win. Here is your winner. A momentum building victory tonight for Carmelo Hayes. And that'll serve him well in his quest to be put on the NXT Battleground card. Another successful title defense for me. Unlucky Fallon, if I were you, I'd stick to riding horses. As for my next challenger, Roxanne Perez, we have a lot of history, and that history will not repeat. Roxanne beat me for my title last time I was on top, but it won't happen again. Mandy Rose remaining confident as she heads into her next title defense with the Prodigy. There is Alma Fire. What a year it has been for Alba Foyle from becoming NXT Women's Champion to being unable to regain that championship thanks to Isla Dawn. It has certainly been quite the year for Alba Foyle. And tonight she is set to address the situation between herself and the modern day witch Isla Dawn. And one can only speculate where this could be heading. Alba Foyer has vowed to bring warfare onto Isla Dawn for costing her her NXT Women's Championship match with Mandy Rose. A word of advice, never get on the bad side of a woman like Alba Foyer. Let's hear what Boyer has to say here this evening. Isla, just because you beat me doesn't mean this is over. You are crazy, but if you want to play crazy, so can I. Oh boy. And well, here comes the woman in question, Isla Dawn. Oh, Alba, I know the future. <laughs> I challenge you to a rematch at Battleground, but this time, when you lose, you have to become my underling. What on earth what kind of stipulation is that? If that's what I have to accept in order to defeat you, then so be it. But if I do beat you, then I get another championship match. Oh, well, there's a nice retort from Alba Foyer. 
Viola Dawn is victorious at Battleground, then Foyer becomes her underling. But if Alba Foyer wins, then she gets another shot at the NXT Women's Title. A title that she couldn't regain thanks to Isla Dawn. Are you enjoying the video? Then please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more content. Welcome back everyone to NXT as we are set for women's tag team action. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, Andy Hartwell and Candice LeRae. Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell got a victory last week here on the White and Gold brand when they defeated Lola Weiss and Electra Lopez. Tonight they look to keep the winning ways going as they take on another duo here in NXT, the team of Tatum Paxley and Blair Davenport. Ray and Hartwell would love to be the next in line for a shot at the NXT Women's Tag Team Titles. And if they can keep winning, they will get their wish. Here comes the team that stands between them and their title aspirations. Blair Davenport and Tatum Paxley. Two very talented women on the NXT roster. They are also looking to propel their careers to new heights. Women's tag team action is about to be underway here tonight. Mindy Hartwell going to start things off with Blair Davenport. As the referee calls for the bell, and here we go. And oh, there's the power of Indy Hartwell. She just shoves Davenport. Oh, but now Blair Davenport. Resorting to her strikes. And now it's Hartwell with some forearms and a kick to the midsection. Now across the ring goes Davenport for the tag. In comes Candice LeRae. A very underrated superstar in WWE. Nice double team there by LeRae and Hartwell. But Davenport leveling LeRae with that headbutt. And now the kick to the midsection, boot to the back of the head. Blair Davenport, just such a dangerous competitor inside of that ring. You are seeing it on full display. Just the ruthless attacks from Blair Davenport. The tag was made and now in comes Tatum Paxley with a bang. Nice double team now by Paxley and Davenport. Oh, and LeRae face first into the canvas. Covered out by Paxley to put this away early on and a kick out. And now LeRae trying to get back into this matchup. Big slap there to the face of Tatum. And now the snap there take down into the next snap. And oh, a cheap shot there by Blair. And LeRae not taking too kindly to that. Down goes Davenport. And now Candace getting Paxley back up to her feet. But Paxley was able to capitalize as the rain went off to Davenport momentarily. Drop to hold into an elbow. And now Davenport gonna shoot the hole. Cobber here, center of the ring on Candace LeRae for a two count. Ray has shown in the past that she is a very resilient individual. Close line by Blair. 
And a second one. Now maybe setting up for the trifecta. Yes. Three close lines in a row. And Davenport is firing up. Boot to the face. My word. Nothing fancy about that. Now Lorray sent into the corner. She manages to find out. Paxley now with the cheap shot. And it's Davenport who capitalizes. Now Davenport gonna shift her strategy a bit, trying to go off to the leg of Candice LeRae. LeRae though, with a kick right back. And now Davenport in the corner, tag. Back in comes Indy Hartwell. Double arm ringers, double kicks. First to the midsection and then to the back. And now Hartwell feeling it. Indy Hartwell gonna set up Blair. Perhaps thinking about a suplex, but Davenport from behind. Hartwell in the corner. Davenport with that flying forearm. And now heading up to the middle right. Davenport missed out. And now Indy Hartwell with an opening. Sidewalk slam. In the cover. Shoulders down here on Davenport for a two count. Not quite enough to put away Blair. Oh, and there's a shot right to the face. Shot to the chest. And Davenport driving Indy Hartwell out of the ring. Davenport and Paxley in control. Can Indy Hartwell bounce back here tonight on NXT? We are back here on NXT as Blair Davenport and Tatum Paxley take on Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell. And Hartwell beginning to fight back in this contest. Davenport though blocks the forearm. Hartwell retorts with that kick. And now Davenport sent back into the corner. Tag to Candice LeRae. Now what the hell is this? Whoa! I have never seen that from them before. Great move, and now Candice on the move. Through the ropes, into a DDT. Keeping up the pressure on Davenport. Blair can really use a tag at this juncture. Oh, but the way, looking to end it. Gargano escape. Shout out to Johnny Wrestling. Oh, and there's Paxley. Tatum Paxley saving the matchup. And Candice now missed out with the Inzaguri. Davenport looking for a tag of her own, and there it is. Back in comes Tatum Paxley. And now Paxley lining up Murray. Need the skull. And Candace could be out of it. Here's the cover. Indy Hartwell in the ring to break things up. Now Paxley frustrated as she goes off to Indy Hartwell. The ring from behind. Murray rolling up. Tatum Paxley for a two count. Code breaker. Tag. Back to Hartwell. And there's the spine buster. That could do it. That could finish off Paxley. Shoulders are down. Kick out. Paxley remaining in the matchup. Oh, and there's a jewel breaker. Dazing Hartwell. And now Paxley looking to follow up. Hartwell spiked. Come on. And Indy still in it. Indy though had to roll to the outside. And look at Paxley going off to Candice LeRae. She's not even the legal competitor. Indy Hartwell is the legal superstar. And now Hartwell back into the ring, trying to go off to Tatum. Big strikes. And now into the hammerlock. Paxley down on one knee momentarily. 
Now it's Paxley firing back with a drop kick there to the chest. And oh, Hartwell through the legs. Indy Hartwell close the line. And Hartwell firing back in her own right. NXT Universe firmly behind her. Davenport is down. Pivotal point now in this matchup. Hartwell trying to put away Paxley. Plots her back first into the canvas. Oh, and a kick out at two by Paxley. Still not quite enough to get the victory. And oh, Paxley. Wiping out Indy Hartwell. Now trying to take advantage, Hartwell, no spine buster. Great counter into the spine buster. And Hartwell thinks this is over. Trying to add the exclamation point on Tatum. Full Nelson into that reverse STO. An homage to Johnny Gargano. Davenport knocked off of the apron, here's the cover. The Ray and Hartwell with another victory. Here are your winners, Candice LeRae and Indy Hartwell. And with that victory, Hartwell and LeRae may have just got themselves into contention for the NXT Women's Tag Team titles. Coming soon to Universe Mode, the next NXT Premium Live Event, NXT Battleground. Don't miss this night of great in-ring action as grudge matches take place. Championships are put on the line. NXT Battleground, coming soon to Universe Mode. Welcome back everyone to NXT. And it's time for our main event. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Hagerstown, Maryland. Weighing in at 230 pounds. L.A. Knight. L.A. Knight has done a great job of carrying this brand. Being the face of NXT for a number of months. But at Halloween Havoc, that all changed as LA Knight lost the NXT Championship to Braun Breaker. He gets his rematch in two weeks at Battleground. Will the Megastar be able to recapture the NXT title? Find out in two weeks. Tonight though, the Megastar goes one-on-one -on -one with the modern day Marvel Roger. There is Jinder Mahal. And his opponent, representing Industrial from Punjab, India, weighing in at 238 pounds, the modern day Maharaja, Jinder Mahal. Jinder Mahal looking for a massive victory here tonight over the former NXT champion. LA Knight, meanwhile, was looking to rebound from his loss. It's a Braun Breaker at Halloween Havoc. This is our main event. Here tonight on NXT, and we are almost underway. Here we go, Knight and Mahal. And LA Knight not wasting any time. Big right hand in Mahal. Mahal fires back with a back elbow, and now he just rakes LA Knight. Oh, but wait a minute. Knight now with a forearm smash. And from behind, check out the power of the Megastar. And Mahal right back up. Knee there to the midsection. 
And now Jinder hoisting Knight into the corner. And now he's just going to stomp him out. Listen to the boos from the NXT Universes. Wait a second. LA Knight tripping up the modern day Maharaja. Oh, knee that of a skull. The NXT Universe firmly behind the former NXT Champion as Knight missed out, as did Jinder. And now Jinder sent into the corner. Oh, what a shot there in the face. Now the hall all over the Megastar. Oh, just burying a knee into the gut of LA Knight. And Mahal trying to follow up, LA Knight kicks him away and went for the clothesline, but there's a kick to the gut by Mahal. And a back elbow will find its mark. LA Knight forced to roll the outside. Can the former NXT champion bounce back? This is our main event here tonight on NXT. The former NXT champion, LA Knight, looking to bounce back from his loss to Braun Breaker of Halloween Havoc. Head a takedown, nicely done. And now the double axe handle, followed up with a shoulder tackle. And LA Knight getting something going right now, big clothesline. And Shinder is reeling up a cut in the corner. Now Knight, measuring the modern day Maharaja, catches a back elbow, and Shinder missing out with the boot. Knight goes right to the gut. And again, the power of LA Knight on the display as Mahal gets hung up to dry. And now Knight thinking about the mega star elbow. Jinder getting out of dodge. And now Jinder hoisting up Knight. Elbows thrown to the skull. And oh, what a haymaker! There's the elbow! Mega star elbow from LA Knight. And now the former NXT champion looking for blood force trauma. Jinder nails Knight. And now here comes the Coloss. LA Knight saw it coming. Back and forth now between Knight and Mahal. Suplex into a neck breaker. LA Knight keeping Mahal guessing. Here's the cover. And Shinder kicks out. What a main event thus far. It's now LA Knight just putting the boots to Jinder Mahal. Jinder looking for perhaps a breakout moment here tonight. And Knight fires back with some shots to the face. Mahal back into the corner. LA Knight going up. And there's a Bulldog. Clawing the hall face first. And now perhaps some blood force trauma may be coming for the hall. The hall again one step ahead. Straight jacket neck breaker by Chindle. And Knight wisely rolling to the outside. Separation made. LA Knight with some time to recover. Oh, but Chindle right to the midsection. And now sending Knight back into the ring. Jinder measuring his man. Emerald Flosion. Cover to pin the former NXT champion and only a two count. And now Jinder following up right away. Paul Nelson slam, will that be enough? No, not quite. And the frustration has to set in soon for Jinder Mahal as LA Knight tries to get back into this. Oh, look at the chaps. Double leg takedown. And oh, thrown first into the bottom rope goes Jinder. 
Now LA Knight is poised. Knight from behind catches another buck. Oh, look at this, a boot in the face. And now it may be time for the Coloss. Jinder looking to put away Knight. And this would be massive for his career. But LA Knight blocking. Knight able to avoid the Coloss for now. Now the Megastar just trying to take the fight to the modern day Maharaja. Jinder the rolls through. Shoulders down. Shoulders down on LA Knight. Oh, kick out at two. I thought Jinder had him for a second. And oh, what a shot there from Knight. And again with the jabs. Dazing Jinder. Suplex. And again, Knight just keeps Jinder guessing. More boots to the chest. LA Knight in complete control. Is it time for the BFT? No. Jinder hoisting up Knight. And Watson. And again, wisely, the former NXT champion rolls to the outside. Double lap sandal by Mahal. Jinder firing up himself. Knight now back into the ring. And Jinder is in pursuit. Jinder. Oh, and again, LA Knight. Able to counter. And now Jinder being picked back up to a vertical base. Knight missed out with the drum kick. LA Knight, though, remaining in this matchup. He remains fighting. Jinder off the ropes. Into that back body drop. And Jinder with a great retort. Boot to the face. And now Jinder. Jinder lining up the megastar. Knee to the skull. LA Knight may not have a clue where he's at. And now Jinder. Oh, this is a blast to the past. The camel clutch locked in on the megastar. And what is LA Knight going to do? Could you imagine if Knight was to tap out to Jinder? Oh, but look at the strength. Oh, spine fast. Into the mat goes Mahal. And now LA Knight from behind, hoisting up Jinder. Burning hammer. And if that didn't do the damage, then this will blood force trauma. Cover by night, and it's over. Here is your winner, LA Knight. LA Knight rebounds from his loss at Halloween Havoc. So Braun Breaker, can the Megastar regain the gold? We'll find out in two weeks at Battleground.